Hi, this is Cecilia from Tarot by Cecilia, and this is your tarot card of the day for Tuesday, July the 30th, 2024. The card we have is from a very popular deck, the Eight of Pentacles from the Ethereal Visions Tarot by artist Matt Hughes. Suppose I'm a workaholic weirdo, but I love this card. You know, I, don't get me wrong, I can't always find the proper focus 24-7 to do the things that need to be done. And this card helps you with that. So let's see what we got going on. I have a Gemini moon today. It will be conjunct to Mars in Gemini. It will be conjunct to Jupiter in Gemini. And the sun, which is in Leo, will be sextile to the moon. For the most part, these are all rather pleasant aspects, you know, provided you utilize them properly. For Mars is your passion and drive, and you certainly need that with the Eight of Pentacles. You're probably wondering, like, why, you know, a card which just always looks like such hard work. Sometimes we have to, you know, get into whatever, that mode where we block everything else out and do what needs to be done. It is, after all, the end of the month. I'll be working very hard on making sure all of my sun sign videos get uploaded for the month of August so that everyone can listen to what's happening for their sign in the month of August because it's a big, big month. Now, what about you? What do you need to do? All right, it doesn't necessarily have to be with your job, but something which needs your undivided attention, maybe some paperwork, perhaps you, you know, got a rather long to-do list for yourself but feel like you haven't been getting anywhere with it, now's the time, all right? We have some really nice things coming up, and then we have some really crappy stuff coming up to deal with. So anything that can put you in proper I-got-it-all-together organized mode is definitely going to work in your favor. Not too many days out now from me telling you that Mercury is retrograde, so anything you can do to be organized and have things in an orderly fashion is definitely going to help because mercury is going to retrograde in virgo where you know we have that practicality and organizational skills you know that are at play but what happens when things go kaflui <laughs> yeah and let me tell you it's a big pain right so the more you have straightened out ahead in advance i think the happier you'll be and that could be part of what this is it might not necessarily be a really big thing in your life. It might just be getting your life in order. All right. So, and that goes a long way to, you know, being in good shape when you get to the other side of this. Because trust me, you're going to want to be. I want to thank you all very much for being here. I'll see you here again tomorrow. And as always, have a great day.